guys, what's up? Today, I, oh my god, I'm dizzy. But today we're going to be making some marshmallow DIYs. So, I don't know. I don't know what to say, really. I mean, let's just get into it. The first one is going to be a microwavable, um... Rice Krispie Treat, that's it, I knew it. <laughs> Your three, two, in, this is two ingredients, everyone I make, but you will be needing Rice Krispies and marshmallows. I just, that's so loud. So I just have these um, ones from when we made s'mores. They're supposed to go for a s'more, but I just decided why not do one. For this video today. You also need a heat safe mug, container, bowl, whatever you want to use. But let's just get into it. Okay, so I just ripped one in half last night because I made some last night. And um, because my sister doesn't want me using all this. So I have actually the holiday ones. And that's why I have a Christmas cup. I don't know why I'm using it, but it's still fun. So I have this half marshmallow. I'm just going to put it in my mug and warm it up for 20 seconds. So I'll be right back. Okay, this is what it looks like seconds after I take it out of the microwave. And I'm just going to take a fork and mix it on up. And it should be really sticky. It smells bad. It smells delicious. People on my apple, please. Sorry. There we go. You almost cut me. But I'm just mixing it up. And then um, take your Rice Krispies and uh, add some to the marshmallow. Oh. You don't need a ton, but like, depends on how sticky you want your Rice Krispie. If you don't want it sticky whatsoever, that if you touch it, that's what happens. That like nothing sticks to you uh, you guys know what i mean then you might have to add a lot more of the cereal but i'm not getting picky today so it's very sticky at first i'm gonna move you guys back to where you were because it's a bad position i want to see what it looks like but i'll be back sorry every time i touch my phone it drops but yeah so it's good it's actually really good i'm just going to use a little bit more of these last night was my first time making it and it took me like i think three minutes i know okay so um that's what it looks like to me and i'm just going to mix it kind of like it's really sticky and slimy and kind of gross looking and feeling but it does come together, so I'm sorry, but uh, it takes like a minute or so to mix, get this all mixed in. Sorry, somebody's calling. I'll be right back. Okay, sorry, my dad was calling. But um, it's a sticky consistency, but it just add a little bit more when it's too sticky. It doesn't need a bunch more. It just How about that. That's good, but um. I'm gonna keep mixing this and I'll be right back. Okay, so I mixed for about another minute and it turned out to be really nice and I'm just forming it to the shape that I want it. And I have my cute little holiday uh, Rice Krispie Treat and it's really fun to make it and they are super delicious. Mm. They are so good. They taste as good as the store bought and kind of better, actually. She dropped her apple. But they are so good. And so her peanut butter fell off of her apple. But let's move on to the next DIY. Um, I'm just going to say sorry if it's really dark, but this one I actually have never done before, and I'm really excited to do it, 
and it's DIY edible marshmallow fluff slime and now it's bright yeah I don't know uh, but let's just get into it bro I don't know I don't know you will need your marshmallows I don't know if I said this or not honestly because I was washing my cup um, you will also need powdered sugar oh jeez it's getting everywhere that's why we have a bag Oh jeez, I'm sorry. I'm still here, you know. You're not glitching. I don't think anybody's phone or computer or laptop, whatever it is, is like that. But still. Okay. Let's get into it. Okay, so however big you want your time, you've seen what a half a marshmallow melted looks like. So, I'm gonna go one. And if I want more, I can do two. But, this is edible. Yeah, I was thinking that, but, um, so I just got my one, it was still wet. Okay, never mind. Just warm that up for 20 to 25 seconds, and mix it up with your fork or your spoon or whatever you're using. I warmed mine up for 25 seconds, and it does kind of overflow your cup, but then I'm just mixing it in. Um, okay, you know, kind of slimy, um... You can, but when you touch it, that's what happens. Okay. So, you just, you know, okay. That's very stringy and looks very gross, but isn't. So then, I forgot to get this one. I'll be right back. Oh, jeez. I knew it was going to happen. I held my phone for a reason, but it still fell. Okay. So, I just got my spoon and take my powdered sugar and... Dump it in, in there. I just did a spoonful at once. I've actually, like I said, never done this. So it doesn't pan out, or if I do it wrong, whatever, tell me in the comments down below. Um, but obviously, I didn't get enough powdered sugar, but I think it's actually kind of coming together already. Even though I didn't add enough, it's just super sticky. Um, so. I'm going to stick my hand in here because I'm too lazy to get the, not lazy, I'm just the, whatever, don't care about the spoon at this point. So I'm just wiping it off the knife. Don't do it too early like I did because I mixed it up for like two seconds and I took it out, which I honestly regret now because now I can't pause this and try and get it off my fingers. Autumn, peace for now. Okay, you can use food coloring to color this if you really want to color it. But I decided to make it even more edible and just try and see if this works. I will, though. It's, like, getting all over. Okay, so I have my slime. It's still sticky, but it did work out, and you can kind of see the the color that I put from the raspberry, or blackberry, I mean. You can use whatever berry that has, like, colored juice in it, I guess. But, yeah, so, it did work out. Sorry, my table's so dirty, I need to wipe that up. But, um, it's very fun, actually, to play with, and it, it's sticky. You do need a lot of powdered sugar, and it's just fun to stretch around, and if you don't have any glue, this is actually pretty good recipe because it's even stickier than glue that's why you need more of the activator it's like super sticky guys you have no idea like i have to put this out because it's at the bottom of this cup so i can't really get it oh my gosh it's so sticky if anybody says this isn't sticky you were raised Wrong. But I'm just taking and dipping it <laughs> in. You good, bro? I think she needs the survey. You guys would understand if you. You don't understand. You probably don't. I. You probably do. I mean, you know. But it's very sticky, like majorly sticky. Like if I go slow, look at. 
It sticks to my every move. I have that clean boyfriend that I never wanted to have now. Okay, so I didn't actually even get everything out of the bowl, like, but I'll be back with it, like, all out of the bowl and all not sticky. That'll take, like, ten minutes probably, but I'll try my hardest. I'll be right back. Bye! For now. Can't pause it even. Here, I think it's clear. Not really. But it's the clearest I can get. I remember one time when I didn't have powdered sugar. It was a very sad moment. But it's because I baked every single night for the past month. But, um, yeah. I remember when I didn't have it. And if you want, you can also use flour for this, but I way don't recommend it. But if you really need to, I mean, if you don't have that, I recommend it. But if you do have it, use it because, really, it would taste super gross. I don't like marshmallow fluff, so this isn't the best to me. But I still don't have it all out of the cup. It's been like five minutes. No, it's only been two minutes, never mind. But <laughs> I'll be back, hopefully, hopefully with it all out and it all off my hands and on the comments. So, yeah. <laughs> Bye. Yeah. But um, I did lay the powdered sugar on my counter because um, it is so very sticky. Like, you guys have no idea. Like, you have to saturate this in your powdered sugar. And, oh my God, it's so Jackie, that was a really weird sticky, but it's so sticky, guys. You have no idea. But um, once you get it, okay, I'm gonna go wash my hands so it's not sticky. Oh my gosh, does it rub off? It does. But I'm gonna go wash my hands actually, cause that doesn't help a lot. So I'll be back with this little thing, hopefully. Bye. Should that be from my, like, outro? Not, like, my outro, but, like, when I pause it? I'm not sure. But. Oh, oh, right. Hi. Um, you know how I laid it down here, and I just mixed it in. I also put it on my hands, and apparently on my face. But, um, still, <laughs> I just, you know, have it. And it's actually pretty fun if it's not sticky. But. I'm still trying to get all of that. There's powdered sugar at the bottom. It's powdered sugar stuck. Literally stuck to the bottom. I don't know. But, um, jeez, that was powdered sugar. Um, I'm just finding more of the marshmallow fluff. And I'm grabbing that. But, I'm just gonna get this. And this time I actually won't press play before. <laughs> Um, I say I want to, but before I do pause this, whatever, I just wanted to say it. once again a huge shout out to Billy from that one place, and for the next five days, I will be replying to all comments for the next two weeks that I upload, you know, like I upload tomorrow, I'll reply to you if you comment three days from then, and I'll comment apply like you know I, but yes that's I guess that's just what I'm gonna do so if you guys comment down below what you want me to do next whoever is the first comment I will do and tell me who to do it with like my closest friend a friend your best friend your worst enemy your sister whoever you want me to do it with just tell me but this time I'm actually gonna get everything out of the cup, so I'll be right back. Okay, so I got the most of it that I could out of the um, cup. I almost a cap, but yeah. So um, I'll show you guys it in a second. I'm sorry, I keep saying I'll be right back for now, but for now, you know, I'll be right back. I'm so sorry. I just had to show you guys this. This is marshmallow with some any powder, like a, just an edible powder. Food is confusing sometimes. It kind of makes you wonder, like, I'm eating something that could turn into s slime. And 
just kind of makes you wonder. But I'm sorry. Bye.